plagued by something he calls the other LSD, lead singer disorder. Can I? Lead singer disorder. <laughs> did, we really talk about, did we finish? We didn't finish that. You guys changed the tape. Lead singer disorder. I never thought of it, but I've always, yes, I did. I, yes, I do want to, I, I want to finish lead singer. John, we're going to finish LSD. Let's talk about LSD. Yes. Lead singer. <laughs> of the band, then the rest of the band members sometimes get pissed off at you or jealous or want to know how come my name isn't up there or want to know. Doesn't that happen? It happens hugely so. Um, You're the only person I've ever heard talk about it. Because I guess it's an unspoken thing. It is. They're afraid to. I'll yeah. tell you flat out. It, 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 I put myself in their position. You know, when someone comes up and asks for my autograph because I'm the big lip singer of the band, uh -huh. you know, of Aerosmith, uh -huh. And they don't ask my drummer. I'm so hurt. You are. I am so hurt. So I say, hey, what about him? Yeah. I said, you know, but the truth is, is that they they're not as well seen. They're not as that. The I'm not even an A personality. I'm so beyond that. Yeah. So so when so because of that personality that I am, that I put that out and I'm the dancing bear and all that stuff. I'm the face that they recognize, and it hurts them. And in that, I don't think they, I don't think those guys in the band have really looked at that and said, you know what, I'm just, I'm jealous. Let's call a spade a spade. You know, I was jealous of Joe when he was, girls would come up to him when we first started out. I was. So I get it. Every lead singer gets it from the rest of the guys. Let's talk about forgiveness then. So does it come with you forgiving and them also forgiving? Let's talk about forgiveness and the role that it's played in your life. It's one of the things now that I've learned is forgiveness is the answer to everything. It's the answer to every problem anyone has. Just, it, it's not, some people say, just let it go over. Let it go. <laughs> it's, and you, can, you go, I can't do that. But it's, if someone says, you know what, what if you forgave them? Just do it. Try this. Try to forgive them. Say, I forgive you. And then say, I forgive myself for what I did to you, too. But I forgive you for what you did to me. And I just want to love you. I know it sounds really, you know, or touchy-feely, or uh, stupid, too nice, almost, right? But it's really the answer to everything, forgiveness. Uh, when I left Lady Ford, after falling off the stage, it was all the anger I had against those guys, and boy, I have some anger. But the anger wasn't just about falling off the stage. No, it was angry that they didn't come to the hospital. All right, I'll hold it. Damn it. Even that would have been fun. I would have been felt so uh, healing. If they would, what's wrong with you, man? You, you ruined the toy, but I know you probably use, and, you know, you all right, man? And they said, well, we didn't come because your manager said to stay away. And I said to one of them, you know what? If it was at the White House, I'd have gotten through the grounds to come in and see you. Mm -hmm. I just said that. Yeah. And so it Because the bottom line is, you fell off the stage, they didn't come see you, and what you wanted to know, you know, is what I always say, and I've said all these years, everybody wants to know that I matter. Yeah. Oh, you want to know that you mattered, that you're falling off the stage. Matter. But mm -hmm. somebody cared that, not somebody that the band makes cares that that happened to you. Isn't that the truth? I guess that's it. When you boil it right down to it, I wanted them to come to me. And, are you all right? Yes, are you all right? But you know what I did? What? I called band meeting and uh, I wanted my band. I wanted to tell them something I was, I'm about to tell you. I sat there with them. I begged for their forgiveness. I said, will you forgive me for falling off the tour stage and, and ruining the tour? Will you forgive me for that? And they said, yes. You got it. I got it. And they, said, and they said, I forgive you. And, and after now it's been two years, now the most amazing miracles happened. We're back to the way we were back then. We're going to go back on tour. And everyone's clear again. You said that being a father changed you. I thought, well, it didn't really. Because you continued your life as you wanted it, it felt like for many years without regard for your children. Ooh, okay.